right, what's going on there, guys? So I'm running a screen recording here, so you can see what I'm going to go ahead and do. I'll put the screen recording over here on the left. So I'm going to show you the repairing process for this again, so you can get this communicating with the bird, basically the binding procedures, from step one completely out of the box. So you've charged up your e-hang battery, you've got your your G box charged up, your your uh, ghost drone is ready to roll. You got your phone out in front of you. So what you're going to do? First thing you're going to do is just tap the power button on your on your G box once you'll notice it powers up okay so we'll set that aside we're gonna go ahead and pull this down you're gonna get into your settings you're gonna open your Bluetooth and then you're going to even though it shows it here I've already unpaired it I'm gonna hit search again and let it find it so there you go I'm gonna click on it and it tells you right here what your pairing note is it says 0000 or 1234 now I know mine is 1234 so we're gonna go ahead and hit pair Give it a sec. All right, it is now paired with the G-Box. It's ready to go. It will start communicating as soon as I open the app. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn my screen recording off real fast and we'll start it again here sideways. Okay, so now we're gonna open the eHang app. Let's see if I can turn this sideways one more time. Open the Ghost Drone app here. All right, I'm going to go ahead. Now, it it already said G-Box connected, okay? It just told me as soon as I opened it up that it's communicating with the G-Box. If it doesn't, go ahead and just push the plus button, uh, hit refresh, and you'll see that it pops up here. G-Box is now disconnected. It's going to search for a G-Box. When it finds it, it'll stop here in a sec. You guys can see how this works. <laughs> Give it a, fin a chance to finish its search. Okay, so it knows that it's the UAV-71. We'll click on it, connect it to the G-Box. So there's a couple different ways. That's your troubleshooting for the G-Box, but it doesn't connect. So now we're ready to get the bird connected. So what we're going to do is this is your first time connecting it. I think you only have to do this one time. We're going to go to settings. We're going to go to binding. All right, we're going to pull my phone back a little bit. We're going to open the... Uh, XT connector. I'm also going to show you how to put the battery in properly right now. And the first thing we're going to do is you want to be really quick about this because I think you only have like five to seven seconds. I'm going to go ahead and just plug in the battery real quick. Make sure to be quick. It's a good sized battery. You don't want to fry anything. There we go. And hit bind. Binding successful. It is now communicating with the bird. The G box is communicating with this and my phone is communicating with the G box. We're going to go to confirm. And now I've got avatar and waypoints ready to go. I believe we're gonna put the battery back in here carefully. Let's see if we can show you the correct way to do this here. It goes up through the top. It's a bit of a struggle to get it in there the first time here. Let's see if we can get it all the way through. It's kind of hard to hold it at this angle, but there we go. Just push it all the way in. You may want to struggle with it for a second here until we get it good enough. Let's try to get this on top here. Actually, you know what? We'll try to push it in from the opposite side, see if that helps. You just want to get the connection ahead of it there. Get it in there nice and good. There we go. Then you can close your door. Kind of a bit of a struggle there the first time. You'll figure it out. You'll figure out what works best for you. And let's go ahead and straighten out the gimbal. There we go. So it's in. Like I said, the battery compartment can be a bit of a struggle, but uh, We'll let that re, uh, recalibrate here. Let's uh, get it back on a straight path if I can. Okay, there we go. And we'll test that gimbal out. Beautiful. What's up, guys? Don't forget to smash that like button. It's free for you, and it helps pay me more. It also changes my algorithm, so mad respect if you do. If you haven't subscribed, feel free to subscribe to my channel for more crazy videos like this. And also, I have supplied my email below of every video that I put out in case you guys need to get in contact with me. And below that will also be the address that you can send stuff to. So if you want to send me a piece of mail, feel free to do so. It doesn't matter if it's a package, a box, a hello letter, whatever you guys want to send. I'll be doing a mail time here pretty soon. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the flip, man. Tutoroo.